area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like butterfly gonna recap this. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. Remember me like I'm Pop. Remember me like I'm Nips. Remember me as your brother. Remember me like I'm Big. Look, I always spoke the truth. Looked you in your eyes. It's okay if you cry. Boy, done. Just give me a second half. I'm finna zip cord up. After I get through shanking Mr. Spanish, I'ma tell him Senor Cut. I give a fuck. You already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers at Notification Gang, RiceGangClothing.com for the merchandise. You heard me right. Salute to my guy, Showtime SP. Now, let's see. Rum Nitty versus Cortez. Rum Nitty is the reason why I did not rush and recap these battles last night. It was action-packed. I watched it again. They got apps for that. If you do not remember, in my last joint, do you remember... 21st night of September, I called out Rum Nitty. Yes, I did. I said, Rum Nitty, you need to bring more. They're going to battle again. The channel that Shotgun Sugar Bag. A lot, I got like five or six battles that you had with other people for less than 100,000 that you've been doing better than these performances for, is what I'm saying. Like, you have better bags that you've jumped in against people. That's all I'm saying. And I just feel like if you're going to be the one that's going to be there and going to battle a Geechee or a Swamp, you're going to definitely need to step it up just a little bit more. But um, I said, look, you're winning at a high point. You my dog. You my dog. You my dog. But you need to bring more. I said that I felt like you needed to bring more. Go. Um, and it was one of them things where... You was winning, but you need to start win overkill. Overkill. You need to show the difference between you and these other niggas. Like, get these niggas up out of here. And that's exactly what you did. You know what you said? You said, I don't care about y'all opinions at this point, but I know you cared because you saw that although you were winning, I'm a Brooklyn Nets fan. They beat Celtics last night. I hated the performance. We won. But I didn't like the performance. I loved the defense, but I didn't like the performance overall. I wanted them to step it up. Same way with you. I wanted the Iron Solomon. I wanted the Shotgun Sugar. I wanted the Chilla Jones. I wanted the New Jersey Twerk. I want that killer in that bag. Don't just get by to get by. Smoke these niggas. You know who you are. You know what you do. This is what I was talking about. I got nothing but good things to say about Rum Nitty. Bro, yo, he said... This shotgun got no regards for legends, and this is the proof. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. I'm just starting with Rum Nitty. I'll get to Cortez in a second, but son, that type of stuff right there is the reason why people feel like you could win this whole thing. Gishi Gotti has some, you, Rum Nitty had the performance of the tournament. And y'all know I ain't, y'all, you know what I'm saying? I know y'all could attach me to certain people like, oh, you, that's your friend. Me and Rum Nitty is cool. I fuck with Rum Nitty. I interview Rum Nitty. I rock with his man, Rich. You know what I'm saying? Like, we good. That's my peoples. That's my nigga. I fuck with him. But I'm not going, I said what I said in the last joint. And when I said it, I retweeted it yesterday and I said, uh, I, I went back to the comment that I made about him and I said, uh, what I told him? I told him. I told him once, these mother is dead, salute to be magic. I said, uh, I said a couple weeks ago, we was one, I said this. I said this a couple weeks ago, wanting Rum Nitty to do more, and he delivered. I stand corrected, and I thank you. That man went crazy. He said, my mother effing nigga. I said, you did it, fam. Congratulations. This is the level we knew you could channel. Keep it going. Y'all be thinking that the bloggers and the media and all that shit is haters and haters and haters. I'm like, bro. I'm a fan at the end of the day. I'm a fan with a camera. You know what I'm saying? So if I see that you could be doing more, you could kick. Smoke these niggas, bro. But uh, Cortez, you had a hundred thousand. This is why niggas be doing you like they be doing you. But you had a chance. 
let's just keep it all the way funky. You know what I'm saying? Slip not, let's keep it funky like some gym socks. If you would have got through three rounds, you was not beating that shit that Romney had last night anyway. You was not, he was wilding on you. I know they say y'all was supposed to battle a couple times going somewhere and said, oh, he used the bars he had in Miami. How, my nigga? Did you, was you there? Was you there during the writing process? Did you go on the nigga phone? Did you see what bars he had? Now, I ain't gonna lie. Rum Nitty was hella polished for you for two weeks. I couldn't believe it. I was like, yo, this nigga's rapping like he's in a, in a main stage performance. Like, he's really bugging on this man. Let's get to the bars. Cortez went first. He said, uh, court go after drugs, this a Rico case, the only blue faces I respect is dead to me. J. Cole came back with goals to set the net on fire. Uh, trigger finger quicker than an AI first, and then this nigga chokes, son. This nigga chokes for a hundred thousand? You, you fucking choke for a hundred thousand, son of a bitch. I was like, yo, what are you doing, son? Oh my God, I ain't gonna go too, yes I am, son. He ch nah, B. Nah, B, I'm on some real murder shit. Hey, anybody ever looked at me wrong, owes me money, or said any jealous bullshit about me is fucking dead, B. You choke for 100,000? Go find that man, B. Go find that man, B. You niggas looking like the three stooges of Harlem out here. You niggas is dead out here, B. You can't eat, son. You can't even eat, B. So, from then he comes out his first round. This nigga starts going crazy. Left court with a smile. My nigga just beat a case. Geechee Gotti just beat Casey. Left court with a smile, my nigga just speaks. You can't, y'all niggas ain't even catch that, son. It's okay, that's why I'm here for you. Uh, the reconsider make you think it over. That 100K go from motivation to a motive. Yo, he's bugging on this man. Bring out the first aids on court like Magic Johnson, nigga. What? You already knew you was getting your head punched off. Uh, just smoke drugs and I'm still loaded. Uh, I should have knocked your gay ass outfit. Before I hit the court like Russell Westbrook. <laughs> what? <laughs> I should have. <laughs> I should have knocked you. <laughs> oh, we. That's what I'm talking about. That see, that's the reason why I made that video telling you to step your shit up. Cause that I hadn't heard no. When you start rapping like that again? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. <sighs> that was crazy. Um. Bullets going zoom, zoom, zoom. That's all court hearing now. You know, court hearings are Zoom meetings. That was fire. Cortez comes out his second round. All I got, the only word I got on my computer is sheesh. So he must not have had no material for the cereal. You know what I'm saying? And Rum Nitty, salute to Kwame Brown. He's laying his mama's cooking. He's spraying that, he's sprinkling that seasoning on you. He's putting the seasoning for the reasoning all over you. Simmering you up in the pot, nigga. You you become a gumbo. Let the drum roll. This man becoming gumbo. Do I got a drum roll? Give me a drum roll. This nigga's becoming gumbo for the drum roll. He is simmer sauteing you. And Rum Nitty comes out. Show up bare face on court like the Grizzlies logo. Crazy. Then the shotgun don't respect legends and here's the proof. Killed you. Uh, big ass escalate on court like M1. M1 had to escalate on court. You know, y'all niggas remember, rest in peace to Escalade. That's actually Mark Jackson's brother. Uh, I left the court with no cash like Delonte West. Uh, send your cut. Yo, yo. Rum Nitty had to line about his mom. People say his, he don't get personal. He don't be talking, you know what I'm saying, like about the personal shit. But he got into it yesterday. He was like, my mom died for 100000 Like, not died for 100000 Her life insurance was 100000 She died for us to get the money. And you will too. Like, when he was doing this shit right here, like, you could tell he was really like, nigga, you not only is you not winning, I'm going to embarrass you. Niggas is going to remember this. I'm going to humiliate you. Like, he was with. When you start doing this, you talking to him, motherfucker. He was talking to him. Like, I'm talking to your heart, your mind, your spirit, your soul. You said you have no business here. Wild on him. Cortez came out in the third round. Uh, the final scene, court show. I already had him losing, so it's kind of like when you when I got a nigga losing like this, like getting smoked, and I'm from, yo, bro. Oh, man. Uh, 12 will leave him dead. Who said Blue Lives Matter? Uh, cool. Okay, round, but um, Rum Nitty third round, three rounds like an at bat, three blue round, three rounds blue like an at battle, planting the Springfield like Mr. Burns. That was crazy because the plant was in Springfield, but the Springfield's plant, fucking crazy. Uh, you not a problem like you not a you not a problem like an abscess. Uh, surprised at my gift, I never peaked. 
I'm still surprised at my gift. I never peeped. That shit was crazy. Uh, I give a fuck about what you got under the TSA. It's going through clear. What is going on here? You're never going to get, he said, you're never going to get the court, the, the, the surf battle. But I'll murk you and we're going to still see Ern and Ash. Because Ernesto and Ern and Ash. Y'all want to know what happened? I'm going to tell you what happened. He got smoked. Like, he got smoked. It is what it is. Um, yeah. That's what we're doing. Is that what we, let's not ruin gear because that's what we're doing here. Um, you needed more C4 by the seashore. Um. It, Rum Nitty is, is going fucking crazy. Um, that performance right there can beat anybody. In a fair, I think the, the 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 final battle should be no crowd though. Like him and him and Geechee got got a battle with no crowd. Let that shit happen like that. But other than that, you already know what it is. Showtime, gang. I thought we'd get to see an underdog. But it doesn't seem to be So for you and three The championship will be EFB Anyway, anyway, any oh man, Brad What? What do you do? What do you do when you have it all right there in your hands? You got it. What do you do when that plate is freshly cooked and it's smelling all good? You was waiting, you smelled it, and you got all the fumes. Of, mm, just, oh, I can't wait till I sit down and I'm going to tear this food up. Cortez didn't even make it to the table. Cortez didn't even make He had it. It was so pretty. My neck. Oh. Oh. Okay. Let's 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 just let's just I'm rocking all black because it's definitely time for eulogies to be given and all that. It's all facts. Oh, Cortez versus Rum Nitty. This was the one. Cortez rapping like he want that hundred K. Cortez sound like he need that hundred K. It's right there, Tez. And what happened? You don't even know what happened. First round, Cortez had to go first and he was cooking. He had a J. Cole line with the gold on fire. Nigga, that line was fucked. I was like, yes, let's go, Cole. And then, like, three lines after that, um, you slipped, um, and, and you fell, and you couldn't get up, and, and you couldn't even get back on your feet, and you couldn't even tear shit. Rest in peace, DMX. I'm just saying, I'm not. I, I definitely picked Rum Nitty to win this battle. I definitely thought this battle was going to be a lot closer. Of course, that I felt like it was going to be a lot closer. But I just felt like, I mean, it, from what was going down, Cortez just didn't have it. Like, it just seemed like it was very hard. Once he stumbled and then he tried to get it back, he even threw a Casey bar in there and tried to get it back. But he threw the line out. Niggas went, they was wild, and they was like, yeah, I sound like, you know, I ain't trying to sound like, uh, trying to be like any of these other niggas. Oh, nigga, whoa! I I feel you. You tried to you tried to you tr you know what you tried to do, Tess. You know what you tried to do. You cheated on your girl. And you got caught, and you was trying to find every single way to make it up. Like you was trying to make it better. Like you was trying to to do something to make it better, and it just wasn't working, bro. Just you just gotta you gotta you. You know what I'm saying? You just gotta just cut it. Ah, man. Mmm. Mmm. This is a hurt piece, too, because the squeaky floors are something you gotta deal with. You know what else? Something you gotta deal with? The fact that Surf is about to celebrate this. Surf is about to celebrate 
in his pool with the champagne popping. Why? Because that's something that, that Cortez would have done. It's served it the same thing. What I'm saying is, people, is that Rum Nitty is going to the championship. Water is wet. The sky is blue. What else is new? Ugh. And Nitty, let's not act like Nitty wasn't snapping either. Let's not act like Nitty. Don't do that. Don't do that. Because I've been seeing people talking about the crowds was really heavy on the West Coast. Well, it's kind of hard to, to, to not cheer for hot shit. Shit's hot. Okay? Nitty is an... Every battle, too, we're getting a better Nitty. We're getting a better Nitty. So what more do y'all want from Nitty? Like, what more do y'all niggas want from him? Hmm? I know what I want. I want him to win the whole goddamn thing. That's who I'm picking to win this thing. The only person that can do it is Rum Nitty. We gonna have to talk about that when it's time to talk about that. Cortez versus Rum Nitty, it is a 30 for Rum Nitty. Rum Nitty won every single round. Cortez slipped and dripped in the first round. He stumbled and bumbled in the second round. And in the third round... You really tried. Like, you did, bro. Like, you did. You, you brought flowers. You know what I'm saying? You were standing outside. You were supposed to be my cinnamon apple. But, but you fucked it up. And, and, and I, don't, I, don't, I don't know what any, anybody would do in this situation. I just fear for the next opponent. I just fear for Cortez's next opponent. And then I also know the advantage of the next opponent, man. It's, whoo, man. This is bad. This is bad. But it's your boy Showtime SP to nobody that knows bodies. RiceCaneClothing.com. I don't be saying that a lot. You know what I'm saying? I don't be saying that as much. But I just want to let y'all know that it's still out there. Y'all can still cop the shit. I'm just not rocking it right now because I'm a boss, all right? Bye.